Good morning once again grade 5. So teacher Rex here and today we're going to learn something new naman sa ating na topic for today which is values 5. Okay, so listen. So before we start the day, let us have first our morning prayer. So let us close our eyes and let's pray. So Father God, thank you sa timing at ang kasama niyo magkatipo naman. Maskin hindi kami nagkakita sa mga students, Lord. Thank you sa sa pamaagi through online na mag-learn kami or mag-learn ang tagsag-tagsa namun ka self ng bago naman nga knowledge just this day Lord kagtagay kami sa peace of mind sa understanding ng heart na mga mag-acquire sa imong nga knowledge ng imong partik sa amon Lord nag-bless salamat sa provisions mo Lord sa safety sa guidance sa tagsag-tagsa namun ka animalay uh, we do we have all the glory say mo Lord and then may your precious son our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ Amen okay so let's proceed so our Bible verse for the week was taken from the book of Proverbs chapter 4 verse 7 which says wisdom is the principal thing therefore get wisdom and with all they getting get understanding okay so wisdom godly wisdom to be exact is much greater than earthly knowledge because halid na yun sa ginoo ang aton nga ano nga wisdom and it leads us to his arm okay nga mas malapit pagkikita sa ginoo so let's proceed as a review last time we have learned about how to stay in power or crown how to have perseverance and to persevere our lesson for today naman is about guarding our heart or guarding your heart or guard your heart which was which was anchored from the Bible verse Proverbs chapter 4 verse 23 which says watch all over your heart with all diligence for from it flows the spring of life so perti ka importante sa heart no because the, the Bible the example nga wala ko nung nagahalin ang Spring of life. So, perfect and potent. So, there's a, there is a situation, for example. Suppose a sales agent knocked on your door and offered some of her merchandise at no charge. So, baligyan ka mo sang? Isa ka sales agent sang iya nga mga produkto. Pero wala bayad. So, she opened her bags and proudly brought out rotten fruits. Take note. Dunot nga mga prutas, dead cat, patay nga kuring kag, jar of flies. So, which of this would you choose? Okay, which of this? So, most likely you won't choose any of her offerings. Maskin wala pa bayad, hindi kid ka mong pili, di ba? Okay, so do you do not, because you do not want your homes to get dirty or expose your family to germs, right? Okay, so hindi kita sa gusto sang higko, pagsang mga lain niya mga ginahatag sa aton, maskin wala pa bayad. So you want to protect your home from dirty and dangerous things. And there is another place that is more important. Take note, there is another place na mas importante pa sa imo nga balay, sa imo nga home. And you should, you should be more careful nga sa pagbantay sini. Take note guys, it does not refer to the organ that pumps blood. Hindi ni saya ang ato niya nga, kakubakubagi diri o, kung ang organ, ang inatumod ta, okay? Hindi na saya amo. Instead, it is a part of you that thinks, feels ang nagabatsyag, kag nagadeside sa aton. Kag ang nagapagwa sa aton nga, emosyon ba na? Amunan sa aton nga? Ang tagipuso on ta. Pero hindi na yan ang nagapumps ang heart, ang, ang nagapumps ang blood. So many children today of your age allow dirty and dangerous things into their hearts. So are you a one of them? So later, question nga ina, ipagapamangkot ta ulit sa inyo. Are you one of them? Okay, next. So let us have first our story. 
So the best student in America. So Adam Okin was the best student in America. He is a student in the University of California at Berkeley. His parents did not want him to be influenced by social media, think note, and television. Wala ba social media kag television? So he did not do anything. He did anything on television but he excelled. He did not watch na na in television and anything on television but he excelled and was chosen as the best student in his fourth year days in high school and in his college days. So best student in his college kag high school days. So wala sa nakaagi sang social media kag nagawatch sang television but nag-excel sa. So but today sa ato niya simpo, hindi ta magamit ang ato sa social media because hindi ta nag-learn man sa online class. But hindi ta lang pagpasubrahan. So that doesn't mean that watching television or going on social media are negative activities. But we must choose the pro choose the programs or the contents that you watch because it affects our thoughts, feelings, and actions. Isa gina sunod ta pa, di ba? Mas kinlaay nang makita ta sa social media. Basta doon nagalipay sila. Mas kin din applicable sa real life. Gina sunod ta gin. So God doesn't want you to be corrupted or be negatively influenced by the social media. So ang gino, wala man nagtukot sa social media nga. Mangin nga ko i-corrupt yata. Kag hindi kag wala sa nagsugot nga i-influence sa social media negatively so we must guard our hearts instead he wants you to develop your responsibility as a student a child in the god given talents that he gave you so how let us go back so once again a question how many children today of your age allow dirty and dangerous things into their hearts sa ginalan tao ta sa social media sa mga kakakita ta sa television, ginasunod nyo ina ba lang, mas kinlain ina? So, are you one of them? So, this time, you can answer the question. So, in yourself. Okay, so I hope you're not one of them. Because as a reminder, always guard your heart. Sa ginalan, tao ta. Sa mga kakakita ta sa social media. Why? Because Jesus, nagambal sa John 10, Chapter 8 to 10, this is clear that who look him before me are thieves and bandits. The thief comes only to kill, steal, and destroy. So, ang thief na da, nagatumo da sa the devil. And pwede ya gamiton ang social media para mahigkuan o kung ma-influensyahan ang aton nga heart, ang aton nga mind, tag ang pagpaminsaron, tag nahigkuan niya. Okay, so, as a reminder ulit, always guard your Heart. Very good. So, in your activity, please answer. Ang let's try this. A, B, and C. Pasunod na na A, B, and C. Kag ang live it up. Okay? So, once again, pwede nyo ma-pause and ma-rewind ang video ta. Okay? So, thank you guys for listening. And have a great day. God bless.